To add text to your iMovie, click over here on this T icon, and then all of these will show up here. To see what options or to demonstrate what's gonna the text is gonna look like, you can hover your cursor over each option, and you'll see a little clip it of what the text effect is gonna be. Once you just once you select a text style, you click on it. For instance, I want mm, I want this one. You click on it and then you hold down and you drag it to wherever you want it to go. So if I want it to go in between my frames, I would put it here where you see the little green plus sign or when the green line here, that means that I can drop it. But instead I want it over in front, like a title page. And then you drop by letting go. At that point, this options will come up. That you can select a background and there are a lot of backgrounds that you can choose. And you can test out the backgrounds by hovering your cursor over and you'll see a preview over in the preview box to the upper right. Once you decide on one, you simply click it and it applies it here. Now it's time to actually add your text. So you can, if it's already here, you can click within this box, highlight it, press delete on your keyboard and type in your text. Just like that. Now you can also, if you clicked off, you can, and you really want to edit it again, you can click within this blue box over here that says my text, and then you can once again highlight it here. You'll see this gray box around it, and you can change it again. To see a preview of what this is going to look like, you can press on this little play button here and it will show you what it's going to look like in the end. If you like what you have here, you can select Done, and it will change it just like that. However, if you don't like what you have here, you can double click on the text portion here, and this box will appear, at which point you can change the duration once again, or you can change the way that the title will appear by clicking on that button, and then looking through and seeing which of these you would actually like for your words. Once you find one, then click on it and then select done. But you decided that once you change that, it doesn't go with your background. So to change your background, you simply double click on this itself. You can change the duration again and you can change the background. And here is the different backgrounds that you can choose. Click and then select done and there's your text. You can put it anywhere you want within your iMovie.